Hello friends, welcome to CSOP Space. Today in this video session, uh, we will discuss about how to download multiple files into a single zip. So here I will demonstrate this with uh, some simple uh, sample jump. So let's start. I open my Visual Studio, and here I already created one uh, empty ASP.NET Core API project with uh, .NET Core 7. So this is all the default files that uh, is created when we choose the sv.net core web API template. So first of all, I am adding one more uh, controller here. Uh, like uh, this is the empty. If we use this uh, web API empty controller. And then click on add. And here, like I am rename this as uh, uh, zip files controller and then click on add button now now uh, I also create one folder where we add some sample folders uh, like uh, files download and here I paid some sample uh, PDFs that need to be uh, compressed while we are downloading the files. Now, uh, control is added here. So, first of all, uh, we need to create a one method for uh, downloading the files. So, I'm writing here like a public one creating one way for fetching the uh, folder from the server. So, I'm adding I web host environment and this type uh, environment and then creating a constructor for this controller for initializing zip files controller and then we inject this uh, environment variable it's a web host environment and then environment and then this environment in slice with uh, this value now i create a method for that like uh, public i x and result and then uh, like i'm getting a download files download files and here uh, we're writing a code for that uh, reading the file from that folder and uh, compress this file into the zip files and then uh, return this response from uh, this method so i'm adding a try method here and firstly we get a folder path like where it's a folder path. Yes, uh, writing a subfolder path equal to now it's a path dot combine and then it's environment dot uh, current root path and then and then uh, here we provide a folder name. It's uh, folder name is this uh, file download. And so I write this, this here it's folder name. And then we need to check um, like uh, yes, it's showing the suggestion like uh, return. We return the message here return files like uh, not found we are found message like uh, folder not found found and then we get uh, files from this uh, current folder so where files is equal to directory directory uh, dot uh, 
get files from this folder path that we created here and uh, files uh, dot com means we check a uh, files then how much files here so it's len equal to zero and then like uh, return here like uh, uh, not found means no files found into uh, this folder no files found into into this folder we turn a message here and now uh, create a like uh, now I am creating a temporary memory stream to hold the jeep watches so I'm using this uh, using block in where a uh, memory stream we need to add namespace for this so I think you will be equal to new memory stream memory stream and then then uh, like here I am creating a gbot so here I write in a comment like create a new zip arches and here writing create a temporary uh, temporary temporary memory to hold hold the chip now I am writing is uh, like a chip or chip get for to new uh zip or six then we pass a memory stream and then uh it's zip or is mode zip or is uh, mode dot create because here we create that and then leave uh, leave open so we set this as true because we need to open this now now I am using the for each loop to iterate through all the files from uh, uh, this folder so where we get a file info here info is equal to new file info and then uh, we create a like uh, here we create a uh, new entry new entry uh, in the in the uh, g pouches mm, for each file then where in equal to uh, g same dot create it's a chip what is sorry for this it's this chip or chip dot create entry and then it's file info dot name and then we write the file we write the file content Content into the entry. Now uh, I'm using so you using where so where in like here it's uh, in the stream is equal to entry dot open. intelligence code so i remove this entry dot open and now move it for this 
and then using where file string file string is equal to new file stream new file stream and then then here we provide the file and then it's a file mode dot open and then uh you write up uh, we provide a file access file access dot uh, read and then file string we copy this file string dot copy to file string file string dot dot copy to then here we write a destination it's in the stream now it's a memory we go uh, we go to inside this using memory stream so it's a uh, uh, memory stream uh, memory stream dot seek seek and uh, then here we provide like a positions so it's zero zero two and uh, then it's seek begin from begin to end take a seek origin begin and then uh, we return this chip folder return the as uh, by array then we return return file file uh, memo stream dot to array and here we provide a content type so content type is like a application slash and then here we uh, provide a uh, name it's uh, files like you can uh, provide any then you name here so for now for demo i'm writing this as a hard code it need to hit a bracket here you are now here so i am adding exception for this like exception x then uh, return return the status code make a status code here i am returning this as like 500 and uh, then uh get a message and error record and then here i am providing this message ah mm, here uh, i'm changing the attribute like as a http kit need to be in a square bracket http get and then uh, provide a name here it's name name equal to uh, like i'm this uh, download files now uh, the code is complete now i'm running this application i'm pressing ctrl f5 so this will call this way this is a default api well that, that, that will create it while we choosing a web api attempted now click on execute this showing folder not home i think something is wrong here here by mistake i redirect this so this right is already exists so this showing message here need to add a not mark so i can press ctrl 5 and this again call 
again go and this press it now again run this api and click on execute button now this uh, return all the files as a link so click on download this file is now downloaded so here you can check it this files contain all the files uh, that we take as a sample so uh, this is a complete process how you can download a multiple files as a single zip files uh, so if you have any questions any problems please don't forget to write this in comment box and if you like my videos please don't forget to click on subscribe button and also click on notification bell for latest updates so thanks thanks for watching we will meet in next video session